Uh, here we are with the completed Board of Education shield for Arduino. The Arduino hangs underneath. There are some nylon uh, risers kind of holding it in place. You can kind of see them right there. There's one right there. <clears throat> Two wheels with servo drive. There's the funky way the battery snaps in, uh, I mentioned earlier. It's really kind of interesting and unique. I wish it would just come with a flat five battery uh, across, but this is the way they did it, and uh, when it's on, when it's plugged in, the Arduino always has power, and you can see that by the LED in there, a little green LED way back in there, but the board doesn't all have power. It has three settings. One is just the board, o the Arduino board only, and you can't turn that off unless you unplug this. Uh, so that's zero. One is the board and the... Uh, shield here so it's supplying power to the pins and to the sensors and such so if we reset it we'll be able to hear it and third is the board the shield and the servos it hits a corner backs off turns and heads back to me And that's all it's really programmed to do out of the box is to hit, turn, rotate. So that's the shield, the the circuit that comes in the lesson. The only only change I have here is the top resistor there is uh, is covered in heat shrink tube to insulate it. And that's all I've done on this so far. So now that I'm done with the absolute basic lessons on this, I'm going to go into a next step, and that is this add-on for the Board of Education is a walker kit and it bolts to the side oh, that's the wrong side you can tell by which way the servos are facing it bolts to the side and as the servo spins it walks so I'm a little bit worried about how this will put together because I'm worried about these things unscrewing uh, there are lock nuts on the corners but here is, it doesn't have a lock nut, and then these it doesn't have a lock nut, so I'm worried about those unscrewing. But we'll see how it turns out in the next video.